Hi, I'm Christina. Today I'm going to show you how to get the most out of It's Essential app from Jelly Bees. So let's open the app. The app opens to the main menu. Today I'm going to show you everything you need to know about the My Oils section. The My Oils section is where all your personal info and preferences are stored in the app. Here you can go to My Oils, My Blends, my notes, and my contacts. Today, we're going to go over the My Oils section. This is the My Oils section. My Oils is your essential oil library or private inventory. You can add oils to your inventory from the oil index or right here in this section. At the top of the screen, you can tap the home button to go back to the main menu. If you want to add an oil, just tap the plus icon at the top right of the screen to add an oil into your inventory. Also, tap any of the icons at the bottom of the screen to jump to different sections. Let's add an oil to our inventory. Tap the plus button at the top right of the screen. First, let's add the name of the essential oil we wish to add. Just start typing the name of the oil. As you type, the search will auto-populate oil name suggestions to assist you in finding the oil you are looking for. Once you see the oil you wish to add, just tap the word to add it. I just got two new bottles of basil, so let's add those to my inventory. Just tap the plus or minus icon to add or remove from your inventory. Next, tap add and the oil will be added and stored in your private inventory. At the bottom of the screen, you will see the share button. This feature is useful for tracking the oils you have shared with your friends, contacts, or leads. If you sell and share your essential oils on a regular basis like I do, this tool will be especially useful to you. Let's share one of the bottles of basil that I just added to my inventory. Just tap share and there will be a prompt for you to choose who you would like to share the oil with. You will have the option to share with someone new or with someone that you already shared oils with in the past. I'm really not sure if I've added the person I would like to share this oil with as a contact yet, so let's check. Tap the add contact button to go to the my contact section. If you see the person you want to share with, just tap the name. But unfortunately, I don't see the person I would like to share with. So let's tap the back arrow on the top right of the screen to add a new contact. To add a new contact, tap the new contact button. This is the add new contact page. Tap in the grayed out fields to fill out the information. Let's start with the name. Today, I'm sharing with Mary Jane. The next field is great to denote the type of contact. Contact types can be a lead, a friend, family, resource, colleague, or other. Mary is a lead since she is interested in trying essential oils. Just fill out the rest of the information by tapping each field and typing. Once done, just tap add. Once Mary Jane is added as a contact, I will be taken to the page where I will decide the amount of oil to share with her. I'm going to let her have the bottle to try out. So I'm going to leave this option at one bottle. The plus or minus icons allow you to add or subtract from the amount you wish to share. Below, you can decide if you're sharing drops or bottles. I'm sharing the bottle. You will also have the option to add any additional notes on this page. But I'm just going to tap the share button. Once you have shared an oil, you can see who you're sharing the oil with. If you find you would like to delete the share, just tap on the name of the person, then tap the trash can icon. And that's everything you need to know for the My Oils section for the It's Essential app. If you haven't already, be sure to get It's Essential on the App Store today. Thanks, and I'll see you next time.